Um, hi everyone, as promised, I'm going to show you guys how to set up uh, one landing page and advertise it on multiple sources so that you can uh, see exactly where leads are coming from, from which source. So if you're advertising on Facebook, you want it to see a uh, Facebook source. If you want to, if you're advertising on Google or whatever the um, uh, advertising platform you're using, it'll show that source. Um, so it's fairly simple. Uh, the only difference is some platforms work differently. So, um, you know, if you're using Ubounce or, or, or landing page creators, whatever you're utilizing, it's just going to be a little bit different, but the idea and the concept is all the same. So it's all done within the actual form itself. So what you're doing is you're setting up your form um, to have a, a hidden source uh, or a hidden field. And then within that field, you want to capture things that come from the query string. So uh, here's a quick example. It's going to be a lot easier for me to show you exactly what I mean rather than um, elaborate differently. So let's go in and create a new landing page. And here we're utilizing our own landing page creator, which we're actually not done with yet, but it's it's created to a certain position that um, I can utilize it. So let's say precon page create. Okay. So now that my pre-construction landing page is created, the only thing I need to make sure is that the form that I have set up um, to capture that is actually the one that I'm using. So in this instance, it is. Uh, this is the form that I've set up to capture my information. So uh, now, when you're advertising on Facebook, for example, you're going to say question mark source equals FB as one example. So now, when somebody submits a form, Let's go down here, auto test, auto at agent locator, submit. My email, um, my precon page. I'm gonna wait for that email to come in. I believe my, my precon page, oh, okay. So there it is. And I can see that lead source says FB. Um, now, if I wanted to show that it's from Google, for example, I can say Google, press enter. Now, when I advertise the link URL on Google, I'm going to advertise that URL. When I advertise it on Facebook, I'll make it FB. If I want to advertise it on what other, whatever other source you really want, you can just change it to whatever you want. And when they submit that form, it's always going to have that test, test test submit let's wait for that email to come through again there it is and the lead source says whatever you want so that's the idea um, that's the concept of utilizing one landing page for multiple sources um, and that's about it hope that helps thanks